Hello survivors, welcome back to another video. How are you today, guys? Let me know in the comments. I haven't forgot about you guys. Don't worry. Um, I was just busy, as I always tell you. Sometimes life gets in the way, and you have to remember that life is always more important than the game. But I have been playing, guys. I have been playing. It was Kili Ben, was Capital. I kind of participated just to get the points. You know, some nice attacks. We took three towers for a few moments. Then we end up, of course, losing it. Somebody solo then. And then kill event. We just rally one of these uh, random players who quit the game. Nice attacks to get the points. And that was it. But, guys, we have a lot of changes today in rewards, in stuff. And, of course, I'm going to just um, outline these changes for you. First of all, we have the hero appointment, guys. If you have been waiting to unlock new spots, you know that today you are able to unlock the next infantry and you can unlock them without using the signature budget. So that's what I want you to do instead of using the signature budgets because remember, you are going to need them to keep upgrading your heroes further. And these are expenses because now we have them in the Alliance store. I don't even have the coins to get them. So yeah, I'm gonna be saving the coins and get a lot of them here doing the donations because I already have one. And then if I have, like say, if I get another one, then when I upgrade here my Hunter, I'm gonna be able to unlock further the infantry. And then I'm gonna be able to keep upgrading my infantry and getting these bonuses, guys. And they are super important. It's like the aircraft, guys. If you don't get these bonuses and this stuff reminds, then you are going to be in a disadvantage kind of forever because you have the aircraft and the aircraft is finishing in 35 days. So if you didn't do your homework during the aircraft, if you are in an older state, it doesn't matter how much money you spend or how, no, how much money you spend now because you are going to be able to spend money to get the aircraft. But as a free to play player, it doesn't matter what you do because you are not spending money you are gonna be in a big disadvantage forever forever in your state so if you want to just cut this disadvantage then you will have to start in a new state so you don't want to do that unless not now we are gonna do that later by the way a state thousand is coming you are all telling me to open an account there uh in this moment of my life guys i'm super busy with a lot of stuff so I'm not gonna be able to do a state thousand, but for sure I will do that guys. Before quitting YouTube, before quitting the game, I will open a new account and maybe just buy me another one year of playing, just starting in a new state with all the knowledge I have, with all the experience I have. And then this account, I don't know what I'm gonna do with this account, but <clears throat> yeah. So leaving that aside guys, we have uh, the new aircraft thing here, talking about the aircraft. Where is that? Aircraft research. This uh, was something that was in the beginning. So you get like a material for using material. But let's be honest, some of us don't have a lot of this material. So let's see how many I have. Mm, yeah, I have 95. Ooh. So what I recommend you is to exchange here, you know, to exchange. And then that exchange is going to give you just uh, oh well I got in the same position so it's gonna give you some points there but yeah it is not guaranteed you that you're gonna get like uh, uh, this uh, material but don't do it yet because it finishes in four days so you get your login the, the rewards every day this one daily login rewards and then maybe an event is coming when you get points using the aircraft material and then you go all out with the aircraft material and get as many of these materials as you can because they are good ones for example if you have been saving like more than 120 and you use them and you get 15 and 15 and then like experience certificate it's not bad it's not bad especially because you don't get a lot of points using aircraft material in the event so you might as well use them in a particular event and then just get the extra material just to keep upgrading your airplanes so that one and then we have the alliance throwdown this got me by surprise i totally forgot about this one i'm gonna try to get to get in the top 10 as always but we have new rewards here guys so let's see the rewards <clears throat> in terms of ranking it's the same but alliance rewards now 
is different. So the my stall, sorry. We are getting now here, if we start from the beginning, we are getting plasma cores. It wasn't here before, two plasma cores, three plasma cores, five, 10 plasma cores. And then we are getting this uh, tactical gear designs. It wasn't there before. And that's about it. I don't think that they're adding so many changes. So plasma cores, tactical gear designs, and uh, yeah, the same legendary hero fragments that they always give you, especially if you are in the higher rank. So you have here five legendary hero fragments, and then eight, so 12, plus what you get doing your rank or your alliance rank. And then we have the power spring. So here I recommend you to pair the power spring with the task here. So I'm gonna use 150 plasma. I'm gonna use two, I'm gonna uh, do one of my research. So I'm gonna research my hunter because yeah, I'm almost there for my T11s for my hunter as well, guys. Infantries are waiting, my hunters are there, and then I think that's all I needed for to complete the power spring that I need. Oh no, I still have to use maybe more speed ups of plasma cores because I wanna get my tactical gear design. So if we go here to the gear, I have a lot of material. So looking forward to use that material. We can buy more material here because we rank good in the lion. Oh, I already bought it. But we, we rank good in the last alliance uh, showdown. And then I'm waiting here for the task to be able to get some nice 400, 430 tasks. But uh, yeah, we never know. And yeah, we have that. What else do we have, guys? Um, yeah, we are gonna do the airplane here, guys. While we are waiting for the task, we are just gonna try to pick this monster uh, and get the material just to to use it and to be able to claim full rewards, guys. So yeah, and now I saw some of you had capital and state versus the state uh, last weekend. You guys go crazy. When you share those uh, screenshots in this core, you like them. But yeah, it's part of the... Um, let's be honest, most of the old players, you know, in the beginning, I guess we all were like, oh my God, I have to save troops. I don't want to waste that many troops, blah, blah, blah. But now people are just going nuts, you know, during kill event, during stay versus stay. The game is getting so boring that when you have a chance to have fun, it just like uh, overpasses any logic that you can apply into the game. Yeah, logically you should save troops and be strong, blah, 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 to defend attacks. But if all you are doing for two, for two weeks is killing monsters, is gathering, and doing the trap, and then you get this one small window when you can just attack other players and show your power, of course you wanna go nuts, you know? And that's why, especially all players, the ones who have been playing for a long time, have good stats, and they have a lot of troops, they just wanna show them. Show them who is the boss. So it's the same for me, like, uh, it's not that I wanna show them because I'm not super strong, but yeah, I wanna have some fun. And when I go, I go attacking people. I cannot attack people in my state during kill event. We have a rule, blah, blah, blah. And then if you attack them, people are crying. So, and then the only uh, time that I can attack is during a state versus state because the, for the reservoir we have like, a strategy and some people are designated to attack, blah, blah, blah. So it's another thing. Uh, and yeah, I'm left along with the state versus state to attack people. And that's like a, once in a blue moon, once every month. So uh, it is what it is. That's one of the reasons why the game is getting boring and boring and boring because there are no other events where like you can just go bananas and not lose a lot of troops and that's why most of the people start in new states because in new states you can still go bananas and you know you up uh, there are not the, there is not this, this big discrepancy between players and if you play smart as a free to play player you still have a chance to be stronger than other people who are maybe not playing that smart and even spending like a low amount of money so new states are like uh, resetting the phone somehow. That's what most of the people who quit in other states, they start in new states with new alliances. So that's what I'm gonna do maybe in the future. Of course, I'm gonna do it with you guys, with the one who are still sticking around because yeah, 
I'm still here, guys, after two years. So if I'm investing two years here, why can I invest three years? Especially because I have like a, a good... I, I got to a point where I can balance my life with this game, you know, in the beginning, to be honest, guys, I was just playing like crazy. I didn't know what to go to play. You know what I was doing in the beginning, guys? In the beginning, I was just doing the Explorer trial in the in the Hero Precinct, and I didn't know about battle power. So what I will do is just to go there, and I didn't know I have to upgrade my heroes, or that I have to unlock new heroes, or that I have to upgrade my gear and stuff. I will just spend hours there, guys, trying to just pass the Explorer trial, thinking that it was a matter of strategy, that I have to that I have to be quicker with the buttons, that I have to be quicker with the skills. I will just fail that Explorer trial once, one after another one, guys, like 100 times. And I was just staying there trying to beat that monster, super addictive. And then when I discovered that I could attack other people, oh my god, it was another like a big jump in in like a, a per perturbation in my social life. Because I was just attacking settlements like crazy. All the HQ 6s and 7, I was like HQ 16 or something. I was just annoying people, bullying people to be honest. <laughs> and then getting in trouble. It was just crazy guys. So, but now that I know better that I can just log in to play and, and stuff, so I, I don't just go crazy with, uh, nice. Ah, uh, uh, six plasma cores, we have, oh, we have 10 plasma cores here. So we are actually getting more plasma cores. Six plasma cores, six, ah, uh, yeah, need not 10 plasma cores. I was a little bit confused there. So uh, anyways, I'm gonna shut up. Uh, I'm gonna keep posting videos because now I have a little bit more time. Uh, I hope you enjoy. See you next time.